will be Olympic referee from Croatia, Svanko Ocic. So here we go, everybody. Kamran Gassempour of the Islamic Republic of Iran in the blue and David Taylor from USA in the red. For how many more times, we can't be sure. But maybe the last time. It's not the medal both came to fight for. They both lost to Abdul Rashid Sadulayev. Instead, they meet in the bronze medal contest and what a contest it is George Ram is alongside me for this one it's got fireworks all over that George oh yeah, it, it really has you've got a, a mix of styles between these so you've got David Taylor who loves to go on those low shots low ankles work on the legs you've got Gasson Paul who's very physically strong loves those upper body holds under hooks just to run his man off the mat almost Press is a little bit like a Greco-Roman wrestler sometimes but the clash of two styles from these two wrestling legends. This is, of course, Gassimpo's weight class, however. This is the class that he's been world champion in 2021, 20, 2022 as well. Taylor, a three time world champion, of course, but that's up at down at 86 kilograms. Gassimpour so close to beating Sadulayev yesterday night. He was seconds away from it, in fact. Single leg snatch attempt there from Gassimpour, but then Taylor just doing well. Front headlock goes to that snatch single, but also doesn't get it, doesn't get close enough. David Taylor just doing enough to put this Gassenport on the activity clock. Does not score in that 20 seconds next to his name. Will get awarded one point, but so far doing a great job on that single, finishing it up for the double, gets the two points. And by doing so, kills the activity time as well, so. George, it's not something we've seen at the World Championships on our screens for the entirety of the competition is scoring under passivity. Just great work from Gassimpo, just managed to clear that hand tie, shooting on that single. And once he's on there, you saw it with Sajalayev. He's so physically strong, he can finish the really well. Taylor losing 7-0 to set alive in his first round match. Gassimport, 5-3, he lost. Taylor just going for his own shot there. Gassimport managed to sprawl, get that chest wrap and just hold him at bay. Seconds ticking down in the first three minutes. Gassimport with the 2-0 lead and 30 seconds to think about things George from both sides what would you expect to be the messages and the plan to come in the next period well it'd be great to see David Taylor move his feet a little bit more now he's doing well with his hands but what we used to see from David Taylor was he'd use his hands and feet simultaneously he'd move in he'd move out he'd get Gassimpo moving because Gassimpo is very physically strong so just shooting on him straight away is not going to do it for you. You need to get him off balance, get him moving, and then shoot. Then he's got a big chance. Both these two men are built like super soldiers. Gas in port is just so powerful when he drives it through. But then there's the deafness as well, stepping out of that shot from Taylor.
shot attempt from Gassimpour. Taylor sprawls, shot from Taylor. Gassimpour sprawls, both on the edge. Beautiful shot there. Beautiful work from David Taylor. Switches the angle, cuts him back. Now going for that leg ride attempt. And this is exactly what I'm talking about by moving his feet and hands simultaneously. Before it was just hands, then feet. Now it was hands and feet at the same time. Beautiful shot from Taylor on the clock. Lightning fast high crotch there. He's got gas and pour on the run. <laughs> the magic man producing a touch of it. 4 2 ahead. Two minutes remaining. Bronze medal up for grabs at 92 kilos. David Taylor has come out of retirement for this competition because he wasn't done yet. The fires were relit over the summer watching the Paris Olympics. Qualified through US trials to be here to face Sadolayev principally, but Gassimpour, the bonus encounter. And now it's the encounter to salvage the campaign after losing to Sadolayev. 4 2 ahead into the last 90 seconds. Canadian American coaches shouting that he, David Taylor needs to keep moving, he needs to move his feet, don't stay still against the powerful Iranian. Can't afford to just relax and switch off for a second. With 35 seconds left on this clock, it's going to be incredibly close towards the end. Shot from Gassimpov, a good attempt. Underhook block from Taylor. 20 seconds left. Gassimpov knows how to leave it late. Taylor so focused, furrows the brow, gets ready for the barrage. Just on the edge for two. And for Taylor to come up with it. The victory over Gassimpour. The bronze medal secured. And the USA flags flying. David Taylor wins at the World Championships. He's been the champ three times before. This time, at 92 kilos, it's a bronze. But one that means, oh, so much to the Magic Man. He's been under Oh, so much pressure here in Tirana. Pressure that he's put on himself after coming back, after saying he wanted to do it one more time, after beating Zahid Valencia in the US trials to take the place at the World Championships. And he has justified all that to USA Wrestling, to himself. And George just framed for us David Taylor what he's meant to wrestling, what he means to USA Wrestling and, and what